I'm Mark Langston here and welcome to this demonstration of OneSoci Agency. Now this is an all-in-one social media marketing platform that will allow you to not only manage all of your social media activities for multiple social media accounts, Facebook groups and pages etc but also will allow you or your customers to create and run an entire social media marketing agency all from within this one amazing platform. So what I'll do is I'll dive straight in and I'll show you all of the available features within one social agency. So as you'll see in the left hand column, you've got a number of different tabs down the side and you can see these tabs at the top uh, for different features within one social agency, which I'll cover shortly. But I'll just start off with this new agency feature. And this is where the real magic happens, because this is going to allow you or your customers to start creating and building their own team of social media managers. Now, you can have a maximum of 10 account managers. So this will depend on your level of access access that you purchase. So 10 account managers, and you can do that by simply clicking on the manage members, adding a name, adding an email address, and click confirm. And then that person will receive an email with login details, and they will become one of your social media managers. Now these can be assigned different social media accounts, different pages, different groups to manage, all from the right hand side. So once you have a team member, you can then click on manage accounts. You'll see all the different accounts that you have, the pages, the social media accounts, and then you can simply choose those and assign those to a team member. Now, some of your team members might be specialists in design, in copywriting, in videography, and you can assign them specific tasks to manage on different accounts. Adding new clients is very easy because you can simply send them a link and they can click on the link and then go to uh, connect their social media accounts which will then show up in your dashboard and that's where you can start assigning those different pages to your managers and as you grow your team you can take on more and more clients resulting in a highly profitable social media marketing agency so now let's look at some of the other amazing features within one social agency so we'll start off with posts and you'll see this first feature here enables you to search the internet for all the trending articles, videos and GIFs just by entering a keyword. So this really helps because uh, it helps you to alleviate the problem of having to try and find engaging content. This is proven engaging content that you can find in any niche just by entering a keyword. So we'll start off with articles and in this case I'm just going to enter social media tips, click on search and you'll see here now you've got a whole range of different social media tips you can see by the scroll bar that side there's absolutely tons and tons of content here that you can share with your visitors okay so uh, let's just take a look at some of these so three tips for social media storytelling business to community um, so let's go for 26 tips for writing more effective shareable blog post titles so infographic let's click on that and you'll see this automatically picks up the image. Uh, it's got the title there. And you can see this is the link to that uh, page. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to copy this for now. And you, you can put anything in here. So I'm just going to click quickly paste that in there. OK. And this is still going to keep that link. Now you can choose to post this on any of your um, groups or your pages. You can choose more than one. You can put it on all of them if you want. Um, or your pay or your group sorry so for now I'm just going to click on one Soshi and you can schedule the post to go out at a specific date time and even choose the time zone and then just click confirm so if we will just delete that scheduling for now so we're going to post it uh, straight away but what you can also do and this is an amazing feature uh, which will really help you to build your list through using content that your audience uh, are going to be engaged with but also build your list through using that content and um, leading people through a simple one-click opt-in. So all I'm going to do is click on this one-click opt-in. So I'm just turning it on and we'll click on post now. Okay, so we'll see a message shortly saying that that's posted. Okay, so check your profile. And if I go over to Facebook now, I'm just going to refresh this page and we'll see that that's posted onto this page. So if we scroll down, we can see that here. And something like this is obviously going to be very eye-catching, 26 tips for writing more effective shareable blog post titles. And if we click on that now, 
that will go to this page where people are being asked one Soshi is uh, will receive your public information and email address now this is quite common for people to click on these kind of one click opt-ins uh, when they when they're going through these uh, quizzes and surveys and things like that so it's as simple as just clicking on OK and they go through to this page okay so they're going through to that content and now if we go back to our dashboard then we can click on manage posts okay and you can see here that's currently says zero for view subscribers if we just refresh the page okay and now you can see that's picked up one subscriber okay so you can click on this and you'll see all of the emails for everybody that's clicked on that one click opt-in so you're gaining emails and you can simply download that as a CSV file to your computer and then you could obviously start targeting those emails with Facebook ads which I'll cover shortly as you can see we've got a tab there for Facebook ads and you can also uh, incorporate and integrate your uh, autoresponders again which I'll show you shortly in the settings but for now I just wanted to show you as well with uh, videos so if we just paste in uh, keyword there for videos you can see the same thing here so you can do the same with videos as well so you can find videos like this select a post um, select a post the video to a social media page and basically catch the email address of anyone that wants to watch that video um, also bearing in mind if you're if you do any form of affiliate marketing you can also use affiliate links uh, within one click opt-ins so you can send people to an affiliate link um, and basically add that affiliate link the image will pop up and you can lead them through but you're catching the email address of people before they go through to that affiliate offer okay so that's hugely powerful um, so now I'll just go on to the post designer and this is where you come to create your uh, social media posts you can see we've got hundreds of different templates to choose from so let's say if we pick this one for now that'll uh, place it there in the um, on the blank canvas and you can click on the text you can click on the images you know you can click on all different parts of this you can drag and drop you can move them around you can resize them if you click on font you can change the font here or sorry change the text here you can change the font type okay so if we go back you can change the font size very easy the line height the alignment emphasis if it's bold or um, italic or underlined you can choose the font color the opacity different layer options and you can add shapes and icons absolutely hundreds and hundreds of these down the side here you might want to change the uh, background image so you can change the background image like this very very simple um, if you've got an image that you want to upload yourself from your computer just click on that and you can upload the image from your computer okay and that's back to the themes if you uh, want to download that then you just simply click on download if you want to save it and come back later you click on save and then you'll find it in your designs later on if you make any mistakes you can just reset undo or redo okay and then you can click continue and when you click continue then you can see here this is where you can choose the page or group that you want to post to you can insert text here okay and you can again you can upload a different image here you can click to schedule it schedule the post there confirm um, so that will go out then or you can delete it and post now so that's the post designer if we just go back then you can see here you've got the scheduled posts which we've already covered you can also create bulk posts as well so you can create posts in bulk just by simply coming in here and setting up your post here choosing to schedule if you like but you can just add another you can duplicate so you can spend a little bit of time create a whole um, range of posts a whole different uh, list of posts post to different pages different groups have them scheduled and then click for uh, confirm and have them all going out over a period of time so that's just saving yourself a lot of time um, by getting everything already set up and automate, automatically going out over time. So next, if we go over to cover photo, you can see this is where you're gonna to come to create your cover photo for Facebook. And you, again, you can choose from all these different templates that we've got. So let's click on this one. You can use the template or the designer in exactly the same way. And you can even preview it. So you can see how it's gonna look on your uh, Facebook wall okay as a cover so if you've got your profile image you might not want text behind it so you can obviously then edit the uh, if we go back so if you go back to click on the uh, pro, the preview and then you can go back to start editing the cover so once you've got it all done you can download it and just upload it to facebook 
So let's just leave that page. Next, you can see down the side here, you've got ads. So you can see all your Facebook ads. You can see ads that you've already created. You can create a new ad and you'll see this is where you can use the post designer again to create your Facebook ad. And once you've done that, you can click continue to go through to the targeting. So then you'll see this pop up. This is where you can enter the uh, URL for the page link. You can enter the caption. So this is your headline the description and this is where you can start editing the campaign objective so you've got all these different objectives such as uh, link clicks or conversions brand awareness etc uh, you can optimize the goal you can use uh, the billing event okay so clicks impressions link clicks or page likes okay so you've got your budgeting that you can set the schedule targeting details you've got all this all within this one platform and then you can publish your campaign so if we just go back and you can see custom tabs. So this is where you can create a Facebook tab. So you just put in the name of the tab that you want on your Facebook page and the uh, link that you want it to go to or the, the link that you want displayed on your Facebook uh, page. So just note this has to be HTTPS. And also Facebook recently made some changes. So to do this and to have a Facebook tab, then your Facebook page does need to have over 2000 followers. Okay, so you can create the Facebook tabs, contests, and you can see here, you can create a new contest. You can upload an image, enter the uh, caption, the header, the body, the description. You can enter the button text here. You can enter your Facebook tab name. You can choose different types of contests. So you can choose an info form request, a one-click opt-in or a quiz opt-in. Okay, this is where you set your expiry message. So you might wanna put something like, uh, you're too late, you've just missed out. You can set the expiry date and time. You can choose the time zone. And this is where you'd enter your thank you message and then just simply click confirm. So if we close this, then we'll go back to the dashboard. And just underneath as well, you'll also notice that you can see post analytics as well. So you can also judge at how well your posts are performing. So that concludes this demonstration. I think you'll agree this is a very, very powerful platform, not only for your own business, but for anyone who's looking to create and grow their own social media marketing agency.